Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to this channel, hi, my name is Hi, my name is Anna E, and let's get to 600 subscribers. If you guys are new, hello. So today's video is about um, why am I not working at Burlington Cup Factory. FYI, no, they didn't fire me. And no, I didn't quit. You can hear a lot of tea about this video. So let's get that shit started. I kind of bit my tongue. You know how many times I remake this video? Once. This is my second try. Just because, like, I look like a crackhead. Because I put this on... Ugly ass lip liner. Not anymore. I love this lip liner. I have those two. Both of them are from NYX. This is the shade of Sand Beige. And this is the Butter Lip Gloss of the shade of Bitter Honey. So, I fucking love this combo. You should guys should try it out. Like, let me tell you why. I'm not even working at Burlington Coat Factory. <gasps> but yet. Niños! But yet, I'm still in the system. Weird, right? First things first is that they'll be cutting my hours. Um, retail stores be cutting hella hours. And that gets annoying because it always happens when January starts. Because, you know, on November, I think December. Yeah, November or December, they be like, oh, we got a lot of hours. We can, like, give it to you guys. But, yeah, it was like January. We're on a payroll. Cut the hours. Excuse be cutting mostly my hours because some of you guys do know that i do work at um tj maxx also there's like no communication like when it comes to making new projects actually would they cut your hours or change your schedule like no honey you got my number call me by the store number and also whenever like a district manager comes it's like we have to get everything sorted out everything clean everything neat but it's funny because the district manager doesn't want that shit to be clean. Who doesn't want to come in? Huh? Who doesn't want to come in a clean store? The weird ass manager I've been having. So it's mostly drama. There's never a day with no drama, huh? This is not high school. We're all fucking grown. What the fuck y'all fighting for? Over hangers? Did as over here fighting over hangers. Are you work in the back? A Burlington Co factory or whatever? They be fighting hangers. It'd be hilarious. Like, check that ass hanger. I'm using it. It's not that deep now. <laughs> but it's mostly, it's like, um, small little things to be fighting. For example, the hanger. Well, they be fighting over hangers. Little drama about every single little thing. They be talking crap about co-workers. Like, no way, Jose. That's not gonna be me. I usually stay quiet. I still am. It's just that I don't like to talk to people as much. What the fuck out of my business <laughs> i was gonna say some other word <laughs> but other than that i don't know if you guys knew the other female that used to be on my uh youtube videos a lot because huh, i don't be posting people that i don't be talking to anymore let's just say that first story is that we don't talk anymore so the race is because like they haven't been giving me a lot of race lately the only race they only gave me is like a dollar 25 what am i gonna do with a dollar 25 and keep in mind, I'm getting paid $10.25. They don't care if you get your thing stolen. Like, especially it's like a really, really, really important thing. For example, a vehicle. They don't care. Something happened to my vehicle. And I asked them nicely. I want to see the video. Because that day is like, I didn't went back to work. I just stayed home. And you know, I just make the little police report over there at my house. So they haven't shown me the video the next day. Like, they don't care. And that's the part I hate about it. Like, look, you will not care. That's my shit. I will, like, really talk about it more on my video is coming up. I don't think it was really coming up. But, you know, a video is really gonna, gonna come up soon whenever I post. They expect me to do everything, like, fix up fixtures, build up a fixture, uh, make another room, move some clothes, do the fall season and the spring season. It's just like, no, why expect me to do everything by myself? Like, that's what it did to the other store. They expect me to do everything. I don't like, I know I'm, like, the fastest cat year ever i am the fastest one on the cell floor me and my bestie elizabeth i love her so much like and thirdly you're not gonna tell me to go faster especially you work in the back no 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 so guess what i kind of did it at tj max now i guess who works in the back me like i don't mind working in the back but it's just that oh let's not talk about it this is about burlington not tj max the real question is that did i get fired or did i quit like I said this in the beginning. No, they didn't fire me. No, I didn't, you know, quit. They just haven't scheduled me for two months. Now, I cannot log into my schedule, but yet, I'm still in a system. But the good news is that I'm going to get transferred to another Burlington store. Yes, that's right. I said it. I'm going to get transferred. I know me.
It's because like, I always want to get transferred since last year. But I told the manager, the one who used to work with um, me and my friend Elizabeth, um, he couldn't decide me and Elizabeth because like Elizabeth was going to get transferred too. I'm like, you know, choose her because your wife, she has, you know, some puppies at home. She got bills to pay. I told him that I could wait because I told him that I do have a second job. But I am applying another different, you know, job. So he's like, okay, that's fine. So, you know, it's about to be a year when she did a transfer because I guess she did it when during the summer, I believe. But now it's my turn because I want to get transferred too. If my bestie leaves, I got to follow her. And I guess you guys didn't know. She used to work with me at TJ Maxx too as well. But, you know, she quit. Well, she has to quit because, like, she just got transferred and have a full-time ass job that get paid really, really well. That's about it. That's all I had to tell you. Um, I really hope you really enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to turn on your little notification bell. But, yeah, you guys, um, I'll see you on my next video. Bye.